In this video, I will show you how to transfer assets to someone else's account on Bybit. So let's jump straight into it. Now, because I'm in the UK, currently Bybit is not available in the UK. As you can see, I've got this pop-up which says your IP is from a restricted region where Bybit does not currently provide services or products. So although I cannot show you the physical steps on how to do this, what I have done is put together a quick guide, which I'm gonna talk you through now, on how to transfer assets to someone else's account on Bybit. So to go ahead and do this, the first thing you're going to want to do is, of course, open up the Bybit website or the Bybit mobile app and log in using your email, phone number and password. At this point, if you haven't already, I would recommend enabling two-factor authentication for added security. So what you need to do first is actually access your wallet. So you want to navigate to the assets or wallet section, which is in the top navigation bar. And if your assets are not already on Bybit, make sure to deposit them into your Bybit wallet. So select the asset you wish to deposit, copy the deposit address. Then you want to transfer the assets from your external wallet or another exchange. Once you've done that, what you want to do is navigate to the withdraw or transfer section, which is going to be within the assets page, and then select the cryptocurrency you want to transfer to another Bybit user. At this point, you need to get the recipient's wallet address. So you want to ask the recipient for their Bybit wallet address for the specific asset you wish to transfer. Once you've got the address, you can go ahead and paste the recipient's wallet address into the designated field, and then specify the amount of the asset you wish to transfer. At this point, make sure to review all details carefully, ensuring that the recipient's address is correct to avoid any loss of funds. Finally, go ahead and confirm the transfer, and you may need to complete some additional security steps, such as entering a 2FA code if you do have two-factor authentication enabled, or even verifying the transaction via email. After doing this, the transaction will be processed and typically confirmed within a few minutes to an hour, depending of course on the asset and network congestion. Now you can always check the status of your transfer in the transaction history under the asset section. So just a couple of tips I want to go through with you is to be aware of any fees associated with transferring assets. Bybit do typically charge a small fee for withdrawals. Also make sure to ensure you are sending assets to a legitimate and trusted recipient to avoid any potential issues and if you do encounter any problems or need any further assistance you can of course contact the Bybit customer support for any help or further assistance. Now by following these steps you should be able to successfully transfer assets to someone else's account on Bybit. Always ensure you are using secure and trusted methods for your transactions. So with that being said I hope this tutorial did help you out today. And if this did help you out, I would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like, and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial, and I will see you in the next video.